Superb fairy wrens, Malurus cyanus, are one of the best known and most popular birds in southeastern Australia. In his breeding plumage, the male sports brilliant blue and black feathers, which is a stark contrast to the female, which is predominantly brown and white. Outside of the breeding season, the male is very similar to the female, except for the dark blue tail and lack of red near the eyes. I've slowed this footage down so we can get a good look at him. There are six subspecies throughout Australia, with three alone in Tasmania and the Bass Strait Islands. Shown here are members of the most widely spread subspecies, Cyanoclimus. They breed from spring through to autumn, but some males will keep the breeding plumage throughout the whole year. Superb fairy wrens are cooperative breeders and younger immature males will help feed the new nestlings. They are famously promiscuous, with females usually not being impregnated by their mate, but by males in surrounding territories. However, they will also mate with their male and can store the sperm from multiple couplings. This has created selective pressure in favour of shorter sperm with larger heads and mates that can reduce a greater amount of sperm. Superb fairy wrens have adapted readily to urbanisation and as long as there is sufficient plant cover, especially hedges, they can be found in built up areas. This female was filmed very close to the centre of a major regional city. Their ready adaption to urbanisation and their inquisitive nature can make for some fun interactions. If you want to attract superb fairy wrens to your garden, make sure you have good coverage of hedges and understory plants for protection for the birds, as well as large grassy areas where they can hunt for insects. And it wouldn't hurt to install a bird bath as well.